What's up, everybody? It is more than a couple of days now. And as you can see, my corals are still doing good. <coughs> and I wanted to do this in a live video and show you. <coughs> now, I've had these fish, these four guys in here. I had more. But, like, hierarchy determined that there only should be four. I guess they're all males. I don't have any females. Uh, but this tank has been going on uh, for about five or six years now. Um, it is from reused substrate. I mean, if you can see, the light comes down to about an inch. But then I got two three, four, I got like about four inches of uh, used, cycled, bacteria-rich substrate. You can even see it. Look at that. Look at that. Over here, I got some uh, heavy-duty green ones. Over here, you can't really see it. But I got some heavy-duty green. And over here also. There, you can see it. Um, and you can see I have all this other nasty algae that's been collecting the the poop over the corona year. This is all corona year. I cleaned it up a little bit actually because I wanted to remove some of the nitrite. Uh, well, not nitrite. Uh, the, the, the nitrate. You know, they say, you know, if you want to remove nitrate, just remove some of the chadomorphelia or that. And then I also got a proper light for down here. Make that chato that I got grow and grow and grow. You can see I have some uh, something growing on there, some good bacteria in there. I gotta clean this. Uh, I gotta clean this out. It's like a lot of buildup. I haven't touched this really for about two or three years. Um, and you can see it's all about the lights, baby. They love the light. It doesn't matter what anything else in the tank as long as everything else in the tank I mean like the, the okay so so you feed the fish and that adds waste then the fish eat the food they poop and pee in the water that adds more waste okay then ammonia builds up then the ammonia gets converted by the bacteria into nitrite then the nitrite gets broken down further by something else into nitrate and then the nitrate gets absorbed by the algae and then these guys eat the algae but in order for them to do that the plants that they have inside of them need to have light now you're gonna see I got some uh, of the test strips let's turn on a real light see even with the real light on you don't even notice that much of a difference this is, you know this is a 150 watt light I've seen other lights that it's just this little section here and this little section here Okay, that have the light. I got the whole thing <clears throat> directly on them. They love it. Okay, here we go. Pull out a test strip. Making a video. Hi, puppy. Hello. Can you uh, hold this lid open for a second? Ah, open. Just open this up. Open this up. Let's just do this. Okay. There you can see. Okay. I'm not gonna drop it. Close it. You can close it. Here, take that. Say hi to the baby. Hi. To the wife. Here, take that. Um. Hi. All right. So. You see, I just 
swiped it. I gotta get this little thing to fill back here. Uh, Why are you recording? Uh, because. All right, so you can see here how it has all thing there. Uh, general hardness, calcium, carbonate hardness, uh, pH, uh, nitrite, nitrate. So uh, the, the one that is missing is the ammonia. Okay, but I want to show you something. Ammonia gets broken down into nitrate. Okay, ammonia gets broken down into nitrate, and then that gets broken down into the nitrate. So here we go. Okay. I need you to get right over here. Get right over here. Okay. The general hardness is above 180. It is about uh, 220, 224, 225. It is right where it needs to be. Now, the, the carbonate hardness is at a solid 180. A solid 180. My pH is at a solid 8. Maybe a little bit lighter. Now, my nitrite is 0. Fucking 0. Look at that. 0. Nothing. All the ammonia got broken down. All the nitrate got broken down. And I am left with my nitrite, which is now... Approaching 200 parts per million. Mm. I have had a 900 parts per million. Like this has been this color. This has been this color. All right. Like a freaking crimson red. That's how I knew I was approaching like a million parts per, uh, per, per uh, a million ppm uh, with the nitrite. Nitrate. I get it mixed up. I get it mixed up. But uh, in doing research, I found out that, uh, you know, many fish and corals, they're not affected by the nitrate. They're, you know, it's not a factor to them. What affects them is how the plants that live in their body are dying because they don't have the right light. They have a substandard light or they have a light that you would use for uh, a freshwater fish, you know, but e e even that being said, freshwater fish need some good light too. I mean, they have, you know, algae and bacteria that relies on that light. So, um, uh, the lights that at the time, you know, like uh, uh, five, six, seven years ago, you know, to get a light like this, I would have to pay at, at least, uh, 1500 for it, you know, $1,500 for it. And to get uh, this light, that would be another $900 or $1,500 for it, okay? This, I built this. I built this whole thing. I left these in there because I wanted, you know, all the living bacteria and the larger amphipods and everything to have like a place to hide out and crash but you know finally finally I got the lights and it is because of the lights. and if you look and see on all the live coral rocks there's like you know you're gonna see a bubble or two at the end of the day with this light every single rock has a bubble formed on it Meaning they are all absorbing the nitrate and they are converting it into the oxygen. I mean, it's all about the light. It's all about the light. And if you look and see, like this bad algae that's in the back there, it was it was more it was more pronounced. You can see it's deteriorating. It is actually deteriorating. Mm -hmm. 
the so, back of that tank was really, really full with algae, and it's this is falling off on on its own. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, the bacteria is eating that algae. Wow. Okay, that's algae that the bacteria should have been eating with the help of light. Light is the battery for the bacteria, and I didn't have a good light. I had this light. Come, let me show you. Mexico. Yes, this is the old light that you have. This is the old light that I had. See, the, the, this is this was the day function. This is the day function. This is the day function. That's the night function. I mean, you can actually, like, it's dark out here, and you can actually come out here and see it. So I decided to use that light for my babies in here. And you got baby guppies. Yeah, for the baby gups. Congratulations, Grandpa. For the bubble baby guppies. Oh, my God. They're getting so big. They're getting big, right? They are. So, there you have it, folks. Okay? And uh, I'm going to be putting up another uh, video when uh, I finally cycle the protein skimmer that I built. And uh, I'll see you then. Bye.